Hey everyone, I'm really sorry about my appearance today. I'm feeling just a little bit under the weather and I don't really like wearing too much makeup when I'm feeling sick, but I still wanted to film this video for you today because otherwise it was going to be late. Anyway, today's video is going to be my everyday makeup drawer rotation for the month of May. I have done one of these videos every month this year, so I will leave all my previous ones in the description box if you'd like to check them out as well. Basically, I'm just rotating my products every month to make sure that I'm using everything that I've got, making sure nothing is kind of sitting at the back of my drawers forgotten. So that's basically the purpose of rotating my makeup every month. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you do and subscribe if you aren't already because I do put out new videos every Monday and Thursday. And let's get on to the makeup. Okay, so as always I have left in the items that are staying the same from last month, but I am going to be changing it up a little bit this month because I'm going to be putting my lip products into this little container that holds six and so that way I will just have more space for other things to go in here. So this month I'm going to be putting in a lot of my new products that you've probably seen me haul over the last two or three weeks. So I'm going to start off with foundation. So I did an essence haul recently which I will link down below. So this is the Essence All About Matte Oil Free Makeup. This is the foundation and so that is going in for me to try this month. Then I'm putting in my NARS Sheer Glow. I have this in the shade Light 3 Gobi. And I have only used this once actually for the first impression, which again I will leave that linked down below. So I'm putting it in this month so I can try it out a little bit more. Sorry, I forgot to say I'm leaving in my Rimmel Primer. And I'm also leaving in my Chi Chi Sharpener and my Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. Just because this is almost empty and I'm trying to use it up, but it's holding on for a really long time. I'm also going to leave in this Almay Concealer and Brightener just because... I like to use this on my spots when I have them. And just while we're here, I'll also show you I'm leaving in my Hoola bronzer just because I'm really enjoying using this. And this was new last month, so I haven't had this for very long yet. So for powder, I'm putting my Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette back in. So this one I usually use to set my concealer and my foundation. And then this one I will use as a highlighter as well. Occasionally I'll use this as a bronzer, but I'm putting in a different bronzer that's new this month so I probably won't use that one too much. So for eyes I'm leaving in my Urban Decay Primer Potion Sample just because I don't know if you can see but this is just about empty. This probably has another maybe two uses left in it so I'm determined to use this one up. I'm not putting in the other ones because I do have a new eye primer that I'm putting in so I just want to use this one up and then switch to the new one. Then of course I'm putting in my new Shanexo palette which has eyeshadows on one side and lipsticks on the other side. And I have used this in a few of my videos already. I did an unboxing and then I did a swatch video and then I did a video where I did a spring and a fall look using it. And I've also done a review on my channel so I'll have all of those linked in the description box as well if you're interested in finding out a little bit more about this palette. I'm also putting in this Essence eyeshadow because this is another new one for me. This is in the shade 20 Rosy Happiness. And then for eye primer, I have this Essence I Love Stage, which is what I was talking about before. Two new Essence eyeliners. So this one is in the shade Hot Scorch and this one is in the shade C'est La Vie. I'm putting in two mascaras this month. One is new and one is old. This is the new one. This is the Essence I Love Extreme Volume Mascara. And this is the old one. This is the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. Just because I think this might be almost empty. So I just want to use it before it dries out. I almost forgot this one more shadow. So I'm putting in this Colourpop shadow which is also new to me. This was in my Colourpop haul that I did recently. Again, I will have it linked down below. This one is called Hanky Panky. And then I'm putting in a Colourpop brow pencil again from my Colourpop haul. This one is in the shade Dope Taupe. So moving on to face products, firstly I have this Essence Bronzer. This is the matte bronzing powder for lighter skin. And this one has got a palm tree on it. It's so cute and it smells like coconuts. It smells amazing. And then for blush, I actually somehow managed to buy six blushes in the last few weeks. So of course I want to try all of them. So I'm putting in a bunch of blushes this month. Firstly, I'm putting in these two Colourpop blushes. 
This one is Never Been Kissed, and this one is K-Pop Flushed. Then I've got this Essence Matte Blush in the shade 20 Bury Me Up. Two new Natio Cream to Powder blushes, and I haven't used cream to powder blushes before. I've used these once each, but before that I had never used a cream to powder blush. So this one is in the shade Luscious, and this one is in the shade Joyful. And then the last blush that I'm putting in this month is one from MAC. This is my first MAC blush. I'm so excited. This is in the shade Desert Rose. And I just think that these colors, they're a little bit darker than what I would normally wear. I just think they're going to be really nice for kind of autumn and winter colors, just because they're more berry, slightly darker. I think they're going to be really nice. So that is it for the drawer. Now we are moving on to the lip products. And again, I bought six new lip products this month last month sorry so they're just basically I'm just gonna put all of my new products in here and guess what they're almost all liquid lipsticks so firstly I have these two from Stila the more nude one is called patina and then the bright pink is called Bella I got one new MAC lipstick this is candy yum yum which is a matte formula and again it's a bright pink it actually looks very similar to Stila Bella in the tube, but they actually come out very different colors when you put them on. And then, of course, I have my three ColourPop lipsticks. So this first one is Mars, which is an ultra matte lip. Then I have Bumble, which is another ultra matte lip. And this last one is Frick and Frack, which is an ultra satin lip. So that is everything that's going to be in my makeup drawer for the month of May. I'm really excited to use these things, obviously because most of them are new. And May is my birthday month, so I'm going to be really happy using all new products on my birthday. So I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you did, and I will see you next time. Bye!